So the first step of Thomas Sowell's algorithm that we will consider is issue. So what happens during issue? We take the next instruction in program order from the instruction queue. This has to be done in program order for registry naming to work correctly. We then need to determine where the inputs of the instructions are going to come from. Are they already in the register file or are they going to be produced by some of the instructions that still hasn't broadcast its result? And uh, if we need to wait for an instruction, which one? So there will be some sort of rat table there. We're then going to get a free or available reservation station of the correct kind. Note that there are some reservation stations that are for the adder, some of them are for the multiplier. So if this is an add instruction, then we really need to find a, an available reservation station in front of the adder. If all of the reservation stations are busy at this point, meaning they're already used by some other instructions and they, those instructions haven't left yet, then we simply don't issue anything this cycle. And in Tomasulo's algorithm, they were issuing one instruction at a time. So, so they, they would just issue one instruction per cycle. We would put the instruction in the reservation station then, and we will tag the destination register of the instructions so that the result when it's produced goes there, and also so that instructions that want that register in the future will know which instruction is going to produce this value if it has already not been produced.